So Dylan and I grew up here. We went to high school in Eagle River and we are truly blessed to be able to call this area home in the summertime. Eagle River is home to the largest inland freshwater chain of lakes in the world at 28 lakes. And then I'm up on the Cisco chain just north of here, a uh, chain of 14 lakes. And just having all this water around here in the national forest and uh, the recreation, the tourism culture, there's just really nothing like it. And being able to spend the summer on watercraft like this, can't beat it. So anyways guys, we're excited to show you more about this area, more about the Upper Peninsula of Michigan and all the cool stuff up there. The difference in geology and geography between here and there. And uh, it's gonna be a fun summer, you guys. Here we go. We are gonna go on the water real quick with Gabby next door yeah. and probably do a little bit of everything. Ski, surf, board. The yeah. plan was to head up to Bent's, uh, but we got the last minute calls. So we're like, can't turn down a good surf sesh. Uh, so yeah, that's the plan. We're gonna do that and then make our way up north and go rip the stand up probably. Let's see what's up. We have arrived at Bent's. You can tell by the signage. A little musky, musky sign on the outside here. This is Jack's stopping grounds. Brought the jet ski up. Uh, Jack's rallying the troops. We're gonna get some uh, slalom skiing in tonight here. Should be a fun time. Uh, a little sunset ski action is the best. That's probably my favorite time to be on the water in the Northwoods. It's just beautiful up here. You cannot beat the summers. If you guys haven't heard of this place, definitely check it out. This is one of our favorite spots to hang out in the summer. But Jack's a regular here, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you'll probably see me here. Um, we should be able to find some calm water out there somewhere. It exists. 14 lakes on this chain. Yeah, keep coming. Uh, your tailgate's about a foot off the water. We can keep coming a little bit. That's probably good. It's gonna be a great little launch. Yeah. Ooh. Slide her out on the cardboard. Come on, old girl. Tip. Just 
just like that. Just like that. <laughs> All right, so Dill, this being your first time, obviously you spent a lot of time fishing out here. Yeah. Um, caught some mags in the day. Right. Um, but this is your first time with a stand-up on the Cisco chain. What is the intrigue? What are you stoked about? I just love like how much water there is and so much unexplored water. Uh, it's beautiful up here. Obviously, the Eagle Chain and like the Eagle River area is beautiful, but. This is a little slice of heaven for the people that have grown up here. I personally feel like it feels like Canada, just the scenery and everything. So yeah, it's fun to get up here and go out and explore some of these little offshoot rivers and stuff on the stand up and I don't know, just ride some new water. So uh, I guess show me what you got. All right. I want to see what you got. <laughs> How's the water? Great. A little bit colder than Eagle? A little bit. A little further north, a little colder. Great though. Alright, so you're gonna get gas. We're gonna hop in the boat, head to Morley, grab a ski. Yep. We might ski there. Let's ski there. Ski there. I'll, ski I'll follow there. you guys. I'll ski there. Okay. I'll, dude, here we go. All right, we got a plan. Where's Rosie? In the boat. Look at her. We need like a good old poop. Hi, Rosie. Hi, good girl. Well, yes. Thank you, sir. Shoot nice. <laughs> us. 